Hello guys, I'm Mario with 22 Second Travel. So you are in London and I think it would be good to know what you can do when you're here. So number one on the list is do say sorry. English people are really polite and they seem to say sorry uh, even if the fault is no on the sides. So if you walk past the street and you tap someone accidentally in the shoulder, they're gonna say sorry even if the fault is on your side, so do say sorry. Another thing you can do in London is do make the most of the free attraction. So there's many places where you actually need to pay to get into. And uh, there's so many different that you don't need to pay. So if you want to see the Tower Bridge, uh, well, it's free to walk on the Tower Bridge, walk around the Tower Bridge, but uh, there is a charge if you want to go inside the Tower Bridge. And um, also, you can go around the financial uh, and modern part of the London, which is right behind me, uh, or next to the highest building, the Shard, and also the British Museum and many different science museum. It doesn't cost anything, and all the public parks. So do make the most of the free attraction of London. Another advice is do use the Oyster card. This is a card. Uh, which allow you to travel uh, using the public transport. So the underground, uh, the tram, train, and um, also the buses. So this help you to save probably half of the money you would spend by buying single pass for the underground, let's say. So remember, buy the Oyster card. So number four is do make sure you bring umbrella or waterproof jacket because this is England, this is London and there's a big chance of rain. Even if in the weather forecast there is no chance of it, you never know what's, what's gonna happen. So bring umbrella or waterproof jacket. So another advice is use the right hand side where use an escalator in the underground because uh, usually the left side is used by the people which are really in rush. So in London there is many of them, believe me, everyone is running here. So if you want to stand still on the escalator, make sure it's the right side and not the left one. So the next thing you need to do when you're in London, you need to use the red phone box. It's quite impressive, have a look. Isn't it? Next week in 22 Seconds Travel. That's pretty much wraps the end of this video. Please subscribe to our channel because we've got some more amazing cities coming up. Follow us on Instagram at 22 Seconds Travel. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Goodbye.